so what are the simultaneous equations so this question comes in your mind after uh, after looking at this topic okay please mute yourself okay so this is the first doubt in your mind like what are the simultaneous equation if you are not familiar with it so that is the basic doubt you must all have so nothing is to worry i am here to answer that doubt okay so basically simultaneous equations are a pair of equations okay so what they are saying pair of equation okay so there should be minimum two equations required okay which consist of more than one variable it means there should be more than one variable okay so you can say two or more okay uh usually two we have okay like as per our syllabus you may get uh, usually two variables okay so if we will talk about the example so here you can see the example of the simultaneous equation that uh, it's a uh, here you can see x plus 2 y equals to 8 right and 2 x plus y equals to 7 so normally these are the linear equation okay this one is a linear and this one is the linear but combinedly you can say these are the simultaneous equation why because as for the definition simultaneous equation are a pair of equations so yes this is a pair of equation right there are two equations and the second condition is what that should be more than one variable right so yes here one variable is x and the another variable is y okay so here we have the two variable right so according to that this is simultaneous equation fine up to this now the next topic is uh like basic question is also there like um, like what are the simultaneous equation that is fine but why we are calling it simultaneous equation right that is also general question so the answer is in front of you like uh, why we calling it simultaneous equation because the equations are solved at the same time okay so in this what it means so it means is if you solve the value of x then at the same time you may get the value of y as well okay getting everyone okay now please remove your hands okay only and only if you have the doubt then you can keep otherwise quickly you have to remove your hands okay because raising hand it means you are asking doubt okay so if you have doubt then keep otherwise remove the hands kevin remove the hands abhi remove the hands koshal remove the hands okay kevin what is your question is x2 and y3 because in the first equation if x is 2 and y is 3 then it will be 2 plus 6 and that equals to 8 and then the second one 2 2 mm -hmm. times 2 is 4 so it'll be 4 plus 3 because y is 3 and 4 plus 3 is 7 okay but what is your question is x2 and y3 okay so but that uh, we never told you right and we are not starting like how to solve the question okay so right now what we discuss what is the simultaneous equation what is why we call it simultaneous equation in this two question you have any doubt no right how we will solve and what should be the value of x and y that we will discuss okay and for that discussion everyone is waiting okay so we have many members so you have to wait okay little bit wait it and you will get the value of x and y okay okay so after this there are other things is there like to solve the simultaneous equation we need to find the value of the variable okay so basically they are telling us like solving simultaneous equation it means what whenever you see this term like solve the below simultaneous equation it means what they are asking you to find the value of the unknowns okay value of unknown it means what the variables right and the variables are basically you have x y or any other two variables okay it can be any uh, any variables okay so for example if we take the same example that is x plus 2y and 2x plus y if we will take this then our unknown variables are x and y right so we have to solve the value of that x and y okay so let's see how we can solve the simultaneous equations okay and here we are going to take the same uh same equations i am taking okay x plus 2y equals to 8 and 2x plus y equals to 7 so on the next page you are going to